Can you tell us about your championship? Um, this year, uh, we went back to back. Um, in 03 and 04, I went back to back also, um, and we lost my dad. So, uh, a couple years ago, we found the actual car that me and my dad built, and it took us a year to get it to where we needed to go, thanks to Tim and Alex, Price Racing. And uh, we got it to be a top contender out here. And last year, we won the championship. And uh, I wanted to prove to myself and everyone else that I could come back and do it again. And uh, we went back to back. So looking back on the year, what do you have to say about it? You know, uh, we use the hashtag Family Strong. It's something that I created because I feel, you know, Alex and Tim and, you know, our, the crew I have are actual family. Um, I really believe that. And my actual family, um, my mom, my stepmom, uh, Tonica, to my kids, it's a support group. Um, and everybody supports everybody. This year was a tough year. We uh, had some troubles early, you know, um, had a DNF, and I don't like those. So um, we actually kind of regrouped with four races to go, and we were able to win the championship and win out um, the last three races. So how many races did you win this year? Um, I got to, honestly, uh, I don't know. Uh, they ran out of stickers, so I, that's how I count. <laughs> I think we're I think we're in the plus six range this year. And I remember last year on championship night, something special happened. What was that? Um, it's actually the year anniversary of uh, me proposing to my fiance. We're getting married in January, and. Uh, I'm trying to figure out a way to tell her how I want a three-peat. <laughs> so by three-peat, you're going to come back and race again next year, we'll same division? We'll, we'll be here next year, definitely. I don't know if it's going to be a full season. We're going to try to get more cars out here, um, try to bring more people in the stands, and, yeah, we will definitely be out here. Have you raced anyplace else? Um, I like traveling around. We go to Madeira. Um, we go to San Bernardino. And we go to the big race in Vegas. So we're going to see how uh, this off season pans out. And uh, we'll probably hit those tracks up. Uh, can you just give us kind of a brief how you came up here? Where you got started and what divisions you went through in that? Okay. Um, in 96, um, we had a, my friend Jerry Duback um, had a bomber out here. And my dad, we were doing demolition derby cars. And my dad said, you know, hey, how about we load a car on the trailer that um, can go out and race next weekend. So we built our first bomber um, in 96. We raced that until they until they changed the rule of lock rear ends. So that's when it kind of made us a push to go up to street stock. Um, we built this Camaro um, and started racing it. My dad fell sick with cancer in 03, and um, it was our fourth year of racing street stock. So we kind of figured it was an all-in type of thing, and uh, that's when I won the championship in 03, backed it up in 04, um, sold the car, and kind of fell out of racing um, for a while. You know, life happens and different stuff happens, and then, uh, you know, when I uh, met my fiance, uh, we've been together for eight years now, um, about three years back, she said, uh, you know, you talk about racing and it brings you so much joy, why don't you, you know, go out and race again? And I said, be careful what you wish for. Um, so, social media, you got to love it and hate it. Um, I put it out there and Phil Wilkins is, got back to me and said, hey, I know where your actual car is. So, with a little bit of, you know, bartering and uh, begging, um, I bought the car back and uh, it's out here. It's, it's, it's not as you see now. We had the old body style when we first came out. Um, price racing, did a whole bunch of suspension work and, and front end work and, and framework to it. And uh, we put the new body on it. And um, that's when we won the championship last year with the new body on it. And then me, Alex, and Tim, we make sure that thing runs like a clock, do the adjustments that we need, and uh, go out 